In this video, we will demonstrate how to replace the M.2 2230 solid state drive with an M.2 2280 solid state drive on the Alienware X17 R2. Before you begin, turn off the computer and disconnect all attached peripherals. Remove any micro SD card installed in the micro SD card slot on your computer. Ensure that you always use ESD protection when working inside the computer. To begin, Loosen the four captive screws that secure the base cover to the palm rest and keyboard assembly. Then, remove the two M2.5 by 9 screws and two M2.5 by 5 screws that secure the base cover to the assembly. Pry the base cover from the bottom left and then continue to work on the sides to open the base cover. Lift the base cover off of the palm rest and keyboard assembly. Disconnect the battery cable connector from the system board. Turn the computer over and open the display. Press and hold the power button for 15 seconds to ground the computer and drain the flea power. After draining the flea power, close the display and turn the computer over. Note that the steps that follow are applicable to the M.2 2230 solid state drives installed in either M.2 slot 1 or slot 2. To remove an SSD installed in slot 1 or 2, Remove the screw that secures the thermal shield to the mounting bracket. Slide and lift the thermal shield off of the system board. Slide and lift the SSD from the M.2 card slot on the system board. To remove the SSD mounting bracket, remove the M2 by 3 screw that secures the mounting bracket to the palm rest assembly and lift the mounting bracket from its slot. To install an M.2 2280 SSD in slot 1 or 2, align the notches on the SSD with the tabs on the M.2 card slot on the system board and slide it in. Place and slide the thermal shield onto the system board, aligning the tab on the thermal shield with the slot on the system board. Replace the screw that secures the thermal shield to the system board. Reconnect the battery cable connector to the system board. Slide the tabs on the base cover under the rear I.O. cover and snap the base cover to the palm rest and keyboard assembly. Tighten the four captive screws and replace the two M2.5 by 9 and two M2.5 by 5 screws that secure the base cover to the computer. If you need more information or assistance, go to dell.com forward slash support. 